one thing you're not gonna do is talk bad about my ex. Like, where did you get that glove from? Were you about to murder me? Oh, <laughs> they got my camera! Do I look amazing? I'm recording! Hey you guys, welcome back to Life According to Jenny. It's me. Thank you guys for coming. I'm so excited that you guys are back here. I'm on a real camera. Not for the whole video. This is previously recorded apparently. So sit back and enjoy. There is a little part in this video where a needle is involved where I get a little injection. So if you don't like needles, please skip through the part of the video where I go to the dermatologist. If you're fine with it, okay, let's do this. I can't wait to see you guys on my new camera next week. Let's see what we got going on. Action! Good morning, it's Thursday, you guys. So I have my dermatologist appointment. So I didn't wear any foundation. Does my makeup look crazy? I feel like I look ashy. Ooh. Don't look too close. So headed to the dermatologist to get my keloids injected, hopefully for one last time. Let's take a little look. Let's say goodbye. Can y'all see them? Let's say goodbye. Let me show you my outfit. This is my outfit, dress, Zara, shoes, Gianni beanie, very old from Dillard's, and my hair day turban. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hair, you guys. I need to really just make a decision. Nails, we're gonna go get our nails done. Ooh, yeah, it's about that time. And yeah, I really gotta go, you guys. I'm running later. Okay, guys, I'm here at the dermatologist. Say goodbye to my keloids. Bye, keloids. Talk to you never. Get out of here, please. Any foundation on? I just did my concealer and bronzer and whatnot. And ooh, don't look too close. Cause I got places to go and people to see. Even though when I leave, I'm gonna have two huge band aids. I got things to do, so I don't got time to be out here looking crazy. Anyways, I'll try to film a little bit more. Hopefully, she'll let me film. Jamila, Jamila. Jamila one of them she's the best I love her so much hopefully she'll let me film a little number we'll see okay she said I can film my injections but just not her so let's do this <laughs> it does kind of hurt a little bit but not too crazy nothing too a terrible bit of numbing mixed in there yeah my face started feeling crazy after not like crazy but like a little like I could tell like something tingle. happened. Oh, yeah, okay. I was like, ooh, something happened. Okay. Oh, <laughs> but it was fine. It was it really fine. Ooh. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do me like that. Look. Like you did great. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Let's see. I think we're okay. I don't have to put band-aids because we're not bleeding. And just as soon as I say that. You can put band-aids. Okay. Yeah, we'll just put a couple of spot like band-aids on there. Now. Yeah. Obviously, remove these later today. All right, all done. Whew, thank you. You are welcome. I should be smooth. <laughs> right. Okay, y'all, I'm all injected with my band aids. Hopefully, I'll have beautiful skin in a month. Say goodbye, keloids. You guys, I'm headed to my nail appointment, but I stopped at Chipotle to get a little lunch. Why was it a nice young black man in front of me and they charged him for my food and put my food in his bag? Like, I see y'all couple together, okay. They were like 30, 32 and he was like, what? They were like the steak tacos and the, no, I got the steak tacos. I was like, oh my God, no, we're not together. They were like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. He was like, but I'm honored, I'm honored, but. 
I was like, not they charge that man for my food. He was like, I got you next time though. I'm like, okay. Okay, band-aids. I see you pulling me a little, little Chipotle date. Thank you. I was just like, oh my God. Not that they thought we were together. Just because you see two black people standing in the line at Chipotle. We're not together. Get my food out of his bag. <sighs> Anyways, I'm headed to get my nails done. This nail situation, I'm going to just pray. Lord, Lord, you know how I be about my nails. So just please show me some grace and mercy and let this nail situation go okay go great actually help it to go great so it's a nail shop that i go to but the lady that i go to is not there so i'm just like just anybody do my nails just somebody just anybody i usually don't like to like hop around but like oh i just can't be stable with my nails anyway so i'm going to get my nails done hopefully everything will go great you guys send up a little prayer for me because I be stressing about my nails. Lord, I know you're very busy, but you know how I feel about my nails. So please let this go great. And yeah, I guess I'll talk to you guys after I get my nails done. Just finished with my nails. Cute. And got a bubble tea. I'm gonna take these band-aids off. Oh my god. If you ever go to Fat Straws and get a bubble tea, get strawberry black tea with bubbles, extra bubbles. If you're like me, mm. nails. You guys, my appointment was at 2.30. It is 5.10. 5.10! I did not realize how good I had it back when I used to get my nails done. It took one hour. Two and a half hours, ma'am. What were you doing? What were you doing? She got me together, but like these nails, like, I mean, it's like, okay, but it's not like the best set I've ever had. Two and a half hours. Poor thing. She was like, I've never done almond this long before. So should I go to a different person or you got this? She was like, I got it. I got it. Okay. She did get me together. But like, what? Two and a half hours of my life. I'll never get back. Oh. Anyways, so I am supposed to be. First of all, ma'am, you need to do something to your hair because what? I really need to go home and do my hair. So I usually get my hair done every week or I'll do, I have to do something to my hair every week. So if that's go to the beauty shop, at home beauty shop, something's gotta happen. This eyelash has been feeling like it's falling off all day. Oh, it kinda is. Oh, mm, that's why, okay. So I need to go home and do something to my head because I cannot wear this headdress to work tomorrow even though it would be really cute. But I feel like my job just wouldn't appreciate it, you know? So I really need to go do my hair. But I'm exhausted from sitting in that nail chair for three years. Exhausted. I feel like I need a nap. As long as I have my nails, if one thing is wrong with them, I'm coming back. Like, um, excuse me, ma'am. Um, they're so thin. I feel like they're gonna... <laughs> I don't want to speak that into existence. But they're so thin... like gel all on my hands like oh she was really having a time but she got me together <laughs> oh why is it so hard to find a good nail lady why why is that so hard all right you guys i'm gonna go vent to myself i'm back i'm gonna vent to you guys y'all are my friends no i'm just kidding i'm done venting <laughs> i'm just so confused by this whole nail situation but hey It's 2023. We can do a lot of things. But an almond long nail set. It's not one of them. Okay. I didn't appreciate my nail guy who got me in and out in one hour no matter what I got. I could get rhinestones up and down every nail. I would still be in and out in one hour. <sighs> nail gel. 
I don't appreciate it. All right, I'm gonna go take these band-aids off. So Black Diamond is getting cleaned up for the weekend. Sorry, I was on the phone, so I couldn't really show y'all much. We're getting Black Diamond together, okay? Gas tank still on half. Thanks, X. You know the way to my heart. Gas, that's the way to my heart. You pump it and pay for it. You got me, sold. Okay, we're getting Black Diamond together. And we're gonna go watch the game tonight. I gotta get my hair together. And yeah, oh, and other news, Rainbow. He came through. He he gave a little a little change. Okay, okay, Rainbow, we see you. Cause I did just get my nails done. So thank you, thank you for that. I love a Zell notification. Zell is the only text notification I want, sirs. So no cash app, none of that. Zell di di directly deposited into your account. Available now. Oh. You guys, I'm about to wash my hair, but I'm trying to save my makeup. So instead of going this way, I'm gonna try to go this way. Ugh. So pray for me.
so this is the final look for the hair i'm headed to go watch the basketball game not sure who's playing but let's go let me show you my outfit so i'm just wearing this sports bra from walmart this shorts and jacket set from forever 21 my kurt geiger bag i don't know what shoes yet it's like chill but i think i'm just wearing a plain black louboutins okay bye let's go watch the game i'm over here headed home got me a little jack in the box their mozzarella sticks are really good and the french toast sticks are back and i got an extreme sausage sandwich Now this man talking about he has three kids and newly divorced. What about that makes me want to like you? I appreciate the honesty. Don't get me wrong. But none of that is what I'm here for. None of that. Just not none of that. I have no kids and I'm never been married. So none of that has anything to do with me. None of it her take your three kids and tally ho they're older mm, good good tally ho i'm not here for that this jacket box is so good though nails huh. okay i gotta get inside so i gotta get to bed so i can get to work Good night! The Jack in the Box man was like, oh my god, you're so beautiful. What do you want me to do? Give you my number through the Jack in the Box line? Sir. Sir, no. No. Thanks for my order though. Was it free? So no. I ended up wearing my fave boots. I just keep wearing these things every one second. Like, I can't get out of them. I'm obsessed with them. They're my favorite shoe that I own right now. They're comfy. They're cute. I've gotten, like, at least 15 compliments on them. It's my favorite. My Louboutins need, like, a heel replacement. They need to go to the shoe doctor. I was like, no, ma'am, you're not about to wear those. How my keloids are doing. It was a chill night, so I like don't have any jewelry on, like just nothing. I wasn't trying to do much. So ended up being like Jack in the Box. Cheers, see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Hey y'all. So sorry I didn't tell you guys good morning. I was running very late. Actually, I wasn't running late. So I had to be at work extra early today because I had a training. So I just didn't have time to speak. <laughs> I have on that short Zara dress. Can I just go please? Ooh, thank you. Let me in. I have on that Zara dress that I said was a little bit too short for work. And everyone's been telling me I look so cute and skinny. Hey, so the dress is a hit. Oh my gosh, this construction is just really too much. I'm headed to lunch makeup of the day outfit of the day my zara dress and i just have on my pink christian dior slides and i think i'm gonna go to eatsies for lunch you guys last night was so fun oh my gosh i'm sorry i didn't really take you guys with me because i just didn't but i was having a good time we played pool First of all, I need to get good at pool because I have a whole pool table at my place. I could be really great at pool if I tried. We was playing pool and having a great time on a Thursday. Luckily, I am feeling great today on a Friday because <laughs> sometimes, you know, it can be a lot, but Anyways, I think I'm headed to Eatsy's and I will talk to you guys later. Oh my gosh, that's what I was getting on here to tell you guys. 
So I have a client who always buys like gifts and stuff for me. So he bought like all these gifts for like all his assistants and stuff. And like for Mother's Day and he was like, oh my gosh, are you a mom? I was like, no. He was like, but you're a friend. So just put one in there for you as well. Thank you, sir. He got me a Christmas gift. Like, I love getting a gift from a client. I was like, for me, I'm not a mom, but thank you, sir. He's just a sweet little man who wants me to date his assistant. And I'm just like, sir. <laughs> so his assistant came to get the gifts and I'm just like, hey, I got a little gift for my non Mother's Day. And he was like, yeah, you know, my boss is just so nice. I'm like, I know, right? okay bye <laughs> he's like don't try to invite me to anything i don't want to talk to you sir he's a sweet man but just he's too old you know secure the eatsies eatsies always has the best lemonades like and it's different every day Whew, today was peach so good y'all tell me why this man ran me down in eatsies ma'am Ma'am, I just had to tell you. <sighs> you have the most beautiful lips. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I just had to tell you. Did you? Did you just have to? Did you just have to tell me that? All right, sir. Get away from me. He was old. Get away from me. Grandpa, you guys, y'all know I'm the queen of blocking. I will block someone in a heartbeat. This guy who's been blocked, like, called me no caller ID. And I'm just like, oh, who even is this? You know, it's like a lot of people on that list. So I don't even know. Excuse this. I got to fix my makeup right there. So then he texts me like, hey, this is blank. Unblock my number from, like, I don't know, some fake number. I'm not unblocking you. Like, why should I unblock you? He's like, we're forever. <laughs> we're not forever. Leave me alone. And the, he he just really uh, irks my nerves. Like, he tries to, like, throw jabs at my ex. You don't even know him. One thing you're not going to do is talk bad about my ex. Like, you don't even know him. It's nothing for you. Like, don't, don't bring him up. Don't speak of him. Yo, ex. <laughs> You don't even know him. Do not talk about him. Like, one thing I do not let people do is talk bad about my ex. You don't know my ex. He's literally the best guy. He treated me like a queen. We're just exes because maybe we just need a break from each other. We're not together right now. Like, but you're not going to talk bad about him. Like, what? Sir, let me block this fake number that you made up because what? You're not going to talk bad about my ex. Like, it's just not happening. I, I do not put up with that. You want to get blocked real quick? I'm trying to talk bad about my ex. I just don't see why guys feel the need to do that. Why do you have to da down talk another guy to make yourself look better? I don't. I don't get that. Good morning, it's Saturday. Makeup of the day, just my regular everyday look. My Moni's earrings. I just have on this same dress that I wore on my off day because it's not my off day, I'm at work now. So, show you the outfit. So, Zara dress, my, what did we decide it was? 1211? 1211 baby heels. And yeah. Headed to work, it is Saturday. Yesterday at work was so busy, I was exhausted. I couldn't do one thing. Everyone's like, are we going out? What are we doing? Are you in the streets? Are you going out? You outside? No, I'm exhausted, I can't do one thing. I am about to be a little late, so I gotta go, but I'll talk oh to you guys Oh my later. gosh, you guys, I just met a miniature Yorkie named Max. Who stole my heart? Like, I am obsessed, and I don't, I'm not a dog person ask anyone i'm not me and dogs i can oh <laughs> i was on the ground in this baby dress like max oh my gosh hey like petting him probably need to put some hand sanitizer on petting him like he was the cutest thing i've ever seen 
and he was so obsessed with me she was like he's a ladies man max i said bye max it was so nice to meet you I have to go he was like following me he was literally this big like you know like the miniature like the baby baby dogs like the toy dogs max oh my god i want a miniature yorkie i've never wanted a dog ever Never in 33 years of life have I wanted a dog. Max? Oh my God, he was so cute. I was on the ground petting a dog. <laughs> Who am I? Like, I don't do that. Like, I'm not a dog person like that. <gasps> Max was so freaking cute. Oh, I'm obsessed with him. I cannot get a dog. Like, it's just not, I just can't get a dog, right? Right? Let me get some hand sanitizer. <laughs> Y'all, I was all on the ground, like cheeks out, like dress blowing up. Like, I don't even care. Like, Max, like, hello? That was the cutest dog. I wish I could have shown it to you guys. I just was so infatuated so fast. I couldn't even pull out my phone. And it was two of them. The other one, it was like two girls and they both had one. I was like, oh. That was the cutest thing I've seen in a long time. Oh my God, you guys, do I, do I want a dog all of a sudden? Those miniature baby dogs, they like don't live long or something, I think, because whatever they do to them to make them that small. <sighs> kind of feel like I need one. <laughs> he will be so cute with me. Like what? Am I Kurt Geiger? Like he could totally fit in my purse. Like that dog was literally this big. Oh okay, you guys, I'm I'm done obsessing. <laughs> if anybody wants to give me a dog, I'd be very appreciative. Okay, last thing, I'm I'm done obsessing about Max. What I loved about him was he was like just ch like chilling. Like he said, I'm done with this walk. Like this walk is over. I'm exhausted. And he's so small, like just walking any distance probably takes a lot out of him. He was just sitting down. The girl's like, come on, Max, let's go. Max said he's done. He's done for the day. So whatever, I'm, I'm over it. I was like, can I pet your dog, please? She was like, yeah, yeah. I've never been so obsessed with anything so quickly. Y'all see me with a dog, just call someone because I cannot be having a dog. Like, girl, no. No! You can't have a dog. Ugh, Max, why did you do this to me? Good morning, y'all. It's Sunday. Happy Mother's Day to all the mamas. Tammy Cooper, especially. I'm headed to church. I'm already running late. I think it's 10 o'clock. And church starts at one o'clock. So I have to go outfit of the day. Easter dress, Easter shoes, Kurt Geiger, Moni's. I am back from church. Mother's Day was a success. Makeup of the day, plain makeup. Moni's earring is gonna show you my third Easter dress. <laughs> that I wore for Mother's Day. I was so cute today. Like nobody couldn't tell me nothing. I was friends with the church like, I know. Yeah, yeah. Let me show you my outfit. So I wore this third Easter dress with my same little Easter shoes, Dillard's, Dillard's monies. And I've been wearing my little Amazon rings lately and been getting so many compliments. So this is two rings that I got on Amazon like at least two years ago. It was pouring rain, you guys, like my hair, whoo, I was hanging on. Like I was like, oh my gosh, we really, like my umbrella's in the car. <sighs> Anyways, I was so cute today. So I am about to chill. It's Sunday, as I said earlier. It's raining, so it's just not like, you know, giving much. My mom loved her Mother's Day present. At least she said she did. I hope she did. It's, it's a good one. I hope she really enjoys it. So I'm about to take this dress off and just put on my pajamas and just chill. 
I only could do like a little deep cleaning on my apartment, but I think I'm gonna chill. Oh my gosh, wait, wait. So I bought a camera yesterday that was supposed to be delivered today, but now it's like your delivery is delayed. So I planned on reading like my owner's manual and just getting to know my camera inside and out, but it's not gonna be delivered until tomorrow. So that's a real bummer. So no more phone vlogging, except probably like when I'm out, I might still phone, phone vlog, but I'm gonna be legit with a camera. Woo. So yeah, so now it says it's gonna be delivered tomorrow. So that's unfortunate. So I just been trying to like do like study on like YouTube and stuff like what's a good camera, what's a good laptop, like to edit, what's some good editing softwares, you know, just like studying my craft. So I guess I can still study my craft a little bit more today. I just won't be able to get my camera together. But yeah, so new camera coming soon. I got the Sony ZV-1. That's like just like the most basic like, you know, vlogging camera set for vloggers and bloggers, vloggers and influencers or something like that. So I was like, okay, this is right up my alley. You know, it's like small and compact. Like I can still like put in my purse and take it places. I got a little, what's this called? Tripod, a little tripod so I can be doing my thing. And I'm so excited. So you guys, I'm getting legit. So you know me, the vlogger. I'm just over here turning my life into a reality show. So I'm about to be official with my camera. So I, like I said, I can't read my owner's manual and stuff like I wanted to do today. So my mom, whenever she gets a new electronic, she reads the owner's manual from cover to cover. And I've never done that with one product. Like not one thing. Like this phone probably does things that I don't know that it does because I'm never gonna read one thing. So I was like, I'm gonna do that. So I have some time. Well, today I had time. Now that it's gonna be delivered tomorrow, I don't know. But I'm gonna try to read my owner's manual, owner's manual, cover to cover, so I can really know what my camera can do, you know, so I can make the best out of everything. Anyway, sorry for rambling, but yeah. Probably next time you see me, Maybe not the next time, but maybe the next time after that, I'm gonna have my camera. So, congratulate me, thanks, round of applause, round of applause. Anyways, about to change, and I will talk to you guys later. Doing laundry and watching some Bridgerton knockoff. I really love Bridgerton, so Queen Charlotte, let's see what you got. This show is good, you guys. <laughs> will you please no longer breathe so very loudly? Will you please not talk? I will talk if I wish to talk. What exactly is the problem? <laughs> you have been behaving like a child since my first morning. You have to have watched Bridgerton, though. breathing in my room. Ooh. And a piece of chess pie. Perfect Sunday. Uh oh. Uh oh. Good morning. It's Monday. Makeup of the day. Put on a little wig today. Got my Louis Vuitton earrings that I got for Christmas a few years ago. Let me show you my outfit. Outfit of the day. Garage. Turtleneck. Sleeveless turtleneck. Carbon 38 pants. Duster from image hills from the shoe store and i am headed to work i need to really just go but i want to say hey good morning to you guys because it's rude when i don't i am running late i'm in a hurry this is the hair can y'all really see it she cute gotta go whitening my teeth while i'm at work because why not Crest white strips. Chef's kiss. Hey y'all, headed to lunch. Still whitening, so if I have a little lisp, that's why. 
you guys i'm supposed to be going out with rainbow tonight and i'm just like i just want to go home get my new camera and read my owner's manual is that too much like i don't want to go out tonight <laughs> uh, i'll feel bad to cancel though because he gave me that nail money see that's why you don't need to be accepting things from guys because then you feel like you have to do things for it and really i don't but like I feel like I should give him this date because he gave me money to get my nails done. But like, I just want to get my new camera. So I'm probably going to just go on the date because I will be hungry at that time, I'm sure. So get some food. I just need to go return that stuff to Zara. Pick up my Walmart pickup order. And get my camera. That's what I want to do today. But I feel as though, like, I'm not going to be able to definitely go to Zara. I can probably still get my Walmart order. And I can definitely get my camera because it's at my place. I'm just like, <sighs> so you're really stepping into my Mondays. On Monday, I like to change my bed. Sometimes on Sundays. But usually Monday is my day. And I have things to do. I'm very busy. I'm very busy. He's like, I'm off today. Why are you even off on a Monday? I thought your off days was Friday and Sunday. Anyway, so I guess I'm going to go on this date. I'm headed to you know where on a Monday. Where'd I go? Papados! Yay! Let's go to Papados. I'm starving. I'm always starving. Like, what be wrong with me? I don't be eating breakfast. It's breakfast. You're supposed to break your fast of the night. And I just be having to skip it because I'll be late. I was on time today. I've been being on time like every day for work. I'm so proud of myself. I was on time, but I just didn't have time to get breakfast. In my Walmart order, though, I did give me some of my little um, muffins that I like to get. So that can be a little break fast situation. <sighs> but I'm so hungry. I could just pass away. My stomach this morning was growling so hard. I was like, oh my God, girl, like, I'm gonna have to drink some water because I don't have time to get one thing. I could have walked over to Starbucks, but that's just like 10 extra dollars that like, I don't want to spend. Anyways, about to take my whitening things out so I can eat. Dang it, I left my AirPods at work. It just notified me, AirPods no longer found. What? Ugh, I was charging them. And now I left them at work. That is so annoying. I feel like I just cannot live life without my AirPods. Like, I literally need them for everything to edit my videos, you know? And at Papa Do's, I could be watching my playback of the week. But now I don't have no AirPods. <sighs> this lunch just got real boring. Maybe I'll find a nice person at the bar to talk to. I really don't be even wanting to talk on lunch, to be honest. I just want to sit there in silence and eat my food. No one bother me. I have to talk all day at work. Like, I just want to chill and do nothing. And this Papados, the location, the parking is so annoying. You have to walk a mile just to get to the door because they have all those to-go pickup spots, which I usually am in that spot, in those spots, because I'm usually to-go picking up. But when you have to sit down and dine in, it's like, oh, the walk is so far. Today I got the shrimp platter, which has chicken tenders, catfish, and fried shrimp. Okay. You guys, why Rainbow say he think I'm out of his league? <laughs> I said, if you think so, I know so. So, hey. He was like... Putting on my pout bomb from makeup revolution in candy cute why he say he thinks i'm out of his league i said well that's yeah then yeah look at god i said i did not want to go on that date i was trying to go home and get my camera look at my owner's manual you know get up to get up to get caught up to speed on my youtube situation hey sir get away from me <laughs> Every time I say get away from me, it makes me think of bridesmaids when they all had got sick 
and they were like you know having a situation in the bathroom and the one girl was on the toilet like throwing up and this other girl runs in and throws up on the girl's head because she was like just bursting out and she was like get away from me every time i say get away from me it makes me think of that get away from me sir anyway so it looks like i might be able to just go get my camera and get to doing my thing so i've decided i'm going to learn how to work the camera so i'm going to finish off this vlog on the iphone then thursday thursday we are coming in hot okay hot i tell you with my camera okay so starting so next week's vlog should be top tier i cannot wait i'm so excited so i'm gonna just finish this week off and then starting thursday we are coming in with z camera anyways rainbow we're just gonna have to just ooh. thanks for getting my nails done sir thanks thanks for taking me out on one date and yeah thanks for the conversation in between sorry we had to let you go but it'd be like that sometimes let me add you to the block callers list excuse me guys let me go block him real quick <clears throat> i'm headed to get my camera i'm so excited let me stop being nosy let's get my camera i've changed Ooh. we're gonna stop and get a bubble tea on our way to the mall and then Walmart well then gas probably then Walmart I am killing it I'm so excited got my camera put it in the trunk so no one tries to steal it while I'm in the mall Shh, don't tell anyone it's in the trunk and thank god oh my god I'm so glad it stopped raining because that was really just making me like whoa whoa but I am really excited about my camera, you guys. Oh, my armpits might be a little questionable. I'm really excited about my camera, you guys. So I just hope and pray that I can vlog as easily on my camera as I can on my phone because I need it to be easy. Please let it be easy. They said it's easy, so wish me luck you guys i'm about to get my owner's manual and read it and be official by thursday that is the goal Ooh. okay guys i'm about to get a bubble tea oh my gosh that lady gave me a large i didn't ask for a large do you want to be up all night so you have to get it's called fat straws because the straw has to be huge to suck up the bubbles Mm. I didn't want a large. Ugh. That's so annoying. Okay, right, headed to the mall. I must say, returning things is not as fun as buying things. <sighs> Do I need anything? <laughs> that was not fun. This was not a fun trip to the mall. I don't like doing this. I don't want to do this again. Oh my gosh, y'all. Why didn't I bring y'all to get gas with me? Uh, oh. <laughs> this man said, ma'am, let, let me pump your gas. Let me pump your gas. I'm like, you can definitely do that. Because one thing I hate to do is get gas. But it's the buying it too. Can you buy it for me and pump it for me? He put on this rubber glove. He said, you can't be touching them pumps. You don't know what's on them pumps. Sir, where'd you get that glove from? I was like, you 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 got an extra glove I can have for when I have to pump gas? He was like, nah, for real, I don't be touching them pumps. I was like, oof. He was like, I got some air fresheners though for your car. I was like, where are they in your pocket? He was like, nah, over at my truck. Sir, I'm not coming over to your truck. I was like, oh, okay. He was like, I work at Penske with the yellow bo the yellow box trucks. I can let you borrow my discount if you need a truck. I was like, oh, I don't need one right now, but thank you. He was like, let me get your number. I was like, oh, no, I have a boyfriend. He 
he was like oh okay it was nice to meet you it was so nice to meet you thank you sir for everything sir what where did you get that glove from were you about to murder me <laughs> Where did you get that glove from, OJ? Like, I need to know. <laughs> Walmart order secured. Diet Dr. Pepper, my muffins, and then I'm gonna make some cheese dip. And I got some club crackers. Nothing much, cause I don't be cooking, but hey. Gas tank, I put as much in there as I felt like, what? 50 bucks, you're done, you're done at 50. That's it, that, that's all, that's all I got. Whew, I am exhausted. No, I'm just kidding. I have been killing it today. I'm so proud of myself. I've checked off everything on my list that I needed to do except change my bed. And that's still coming up. You guys, why did my dad say, oh my gosh, I haven't seen you in forever. Do you have any gas? I haven't got you gas in so long. Empty. On empty. And he was like, you should just come home and stay like three or four days. And then I can get you gas. Your mom can cook you breakfast. Sir, I didn't move out to come stay home three or four days a week. <laughs> Why did I move out then? I might as well just move back home. He's like, you can totally move back home. So my closet is turned into a gun closet. He's like, I'll take all my guns out. I'll just have to put them somewhere else. You can totally come back home. I don't want to come back home. I just want gas. That's it. I said the only thing I hate about not living at home is the gas part. He was like, oh, that's it. That's the only reason I hate living by myself. Cause I have to get my own gas. That's not reason enough to move back home. He's like, yeah, all your, your room is still, it's still there. You can just come right on back anytime. No, thank you, sir. But thanks for the kind gesture. I just opened my camera, you guys. It's so small. Here she is, my new best friend. Hey, girl. Ooh. Okay, well. came with this and this and this oh and this maybe this is what I need to insert let's see okay let's see oh let me put the battery in you guys do I have to take any of this off We got a green light. Oh. English, yes. I understand. Connect to a smartphone. That's what I need to do. Okay, guys, I gotta go. I gotta connect to my phone for sure. Okay, guys, look at the camera. So this is I gotta get an SD card. Why would you give me a camera with no SD card? Like, am I missing something? Why, why would you even just give me this camera and I can't even use it? No card, no card, no card. <sighs> so I'm headed to Target, Walmart, Best Buy, somewhere. Okay guys, so in 2023, you don't get a user manual. Just none of that. It's a quick start guide. So let's get started. So I ordered my memory card on Amazon. It should be here tomorrow. So I can't even start looking until tomorrow. It's cool, I have till Thursday. I'm just trying to, I'm just excited, you know? I've been looking for wraps so I can wrap my um, camera like I did my refrigerator. 
because I can't be having a basic camera. <laughs> Hello? No. So I gotta get her real cute. But I haven't really found anything too much. Maybe I could start that as a business. Vloggers, you want a cute camera? I got you. Because it's not much out there. I'm having a hard time. I need like a leopard number. You know, to match my life. There has to be some kind of a skin. Snake skin, leopard, print. Some. I gotta get her cute. She gotta be cute. She's charging right now. We just want to make sure she's good to go when the time comes. Yep, she's charging. Okay, I'm about to take my makeup off and get ready for bed. And I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Oh my gosh, you guys. So quick story time. Sorry, I'm back. I'm back. Quick story time. <sighs> so back in the day, I was in a really bad car accident to where I got a settlement of a large sum of money. And at that time, I wanted a Chanel bag. So I went and bought me a Chanel bag. That's a crazy story. I'm going to tell you guys more about that <laughs> at another time. And so I had my Chanel bag. I was killing it in life. Oh my God, I got my Chanel bag, like loving it. And it was a black and gold patent leather boy bag. Patent leather boy bag with gold hardware. She was everything. So my gold hardware kept turning silver. Excuse me, what? I paid $5,000 for this bag. I expect perfection at all times. They're like, oh my gosh, we've never had this happen. We're going to send it off and get it fixed. That takes a very long time. So they sent it off. Your bag's ready. I go pick her up. Perfection. Oh, so beautiful. I'm like, oh my God, I forgot how good she used to look. Carried her. This is at least probably five years in this time frame. <clears throat> Carried her. She starts turning silver again. I said, not again. Oh my gosh. So I take her to Chanel. They're like, oh, there's nothing we can do. We can only do that treatment on the chain once. Or no, I think they said twice. We can only do it twice and then that's it and I was like so then what am I supposed to do they're like just be like more careful with her this is my everyday bag I can't be more careful with her so I'm like oh my god <sighs> so I just go home sad like what am I gonna do my mom was like let's just return her excuse me what no I don't want to return her I love her so my mom takes the bag to Chanel returns it and calls me like yeah I returned that bag and I'm like, excuse me, <clears throat> excuse me, what? I did not give you permission to return her. I didn't even say goodbye. And she's like, yeah, it's done. Okay. So here you got $5,000. Like what you going to do with it? Save it. We're going to save it. So I don't have a computer, you guys. I've never had one. Well, I had one back in the day, like in college and stuff, but I haven't had one like in my adult life because I just never needed one. Like use my phone. Like that's all I need to do. So I was like, oh, I really need to get a MacBook to like get my editing, like really just chef's kiss. So my mom was like, do you want to get a MacBook? And I was like, yeah. So I'm like looking at the prices and I'm like, okay, oh, this is like so expensive for this hobby that I have. Like it's really adding up camera, MacBook. She was like, use your Chanel money. And I was like, my Chanel money, the gift that keeps on giving. I was like, oh my God, I can totally use my Chanel money and get a laptop. So I just ordered my laptop. I'm going to pick it up tomorrow. You guys, I have not had a computer in years. Years, I tell you. I'm just like, I hope I can still use one. Ooh. But uh, look at me. Computer, check camera check i'm about to really just be legit you guys like y'all not gonna be able to tell me nothing even though i can do like my camera to my phone luckily whew. but my phone has no storage it has no space to do one thing so i'm just like Ugh. so my macbook is really gonna help all these new electronics i'm feeling overwhelmed oh my gosh now i just ordered a lap book lap book is that what it's called? Laptop? Macbook? Lapbook. The two words together. I'm official. I'm a vlogger. So you want my autograph? Just kidding. Okay, guys. Now I'm really going to bed. Good night. It's 12.15 and I'm here with Peyton. Just chilling. I am supposed to be asleep. 
I go to sleep at 10 p.m. That's my bedtime. It is 12 o'clock and I'm wide awake, just like, hello? Peyton, you wanna hang out? Cause I'm, I'm up. I am gonna be so annoyed tomorrow. Like that bubble tea lady, it's her fault. Why would you give someone a large bubble tea at 7 p.m.? Why would you do that? And why would I drink the whole thing? And now I'm just gonna be awake till I don't appreciate this. It's 1.30 a.m. and I'm still here, chilling with McKenna, just hanging out with all the Dallas vloggers, you know? Hey, we're a community. What you doing, girl? She was like, I'm just cleaning out my cabinets. So I was like, okay. If you're up too, I guess it's okay. I really don't like this. I really don't appreciate it. I'm mad about it. Good morning, makeup of the day. I tried to go really glowy. I like highlighted my forehead and my chin. What y'all think? Am I glowing? Headed to work. Let me show you my outfit. Outfit of the day, dress Zara, shoes Bottega. I'm gonna try to go to a funeral on my lunch break today. A really good member of my church died, so I wanna go pay my respects. So that's why I tried to wear like a little dress. Hopefully it's not too short for church. Well, if it is, accept me as I am because this is what I'm wearing. So hopefully I can make the funeral. If not, Sister Barrett, you know how I felt about you, girl. Sorry if I can't make it, but I'm gonna really try. Gotta get to work, I'm already running late. Goodbye, talk to you guys later. Headed to the funeral. I'm so glad I'm gonna be able to make it. I'll get to pay my respects. Probably won't be able to stay for the whole thing. My lunch is only an hour, but I'm just gonna take you know, a little bit longer. What am I gonna eat? What am I gonna do about food? That's the only thing. They be having food for the family, you know, after the funeral, you think I can get a plate? They would totally give me a plate, like, but I don't know. It depends how long the funeral goes. Oh, this light. Here comes the train holding me up. Thank goodness I left early. I was gonna leave at, ooh, this car's about to get, oh no, back up, back up, back up. <gasps> They totally almost got their car slid in half by the thingy from the train. The funeral was so good. I'm so glad I was able to make it. It was literally a good time, which I know that's weird to say about a funeral, but it was. I am headed to Best Buy to pick up my laptop. So I've been a PC girl for my whole life because my parents made me because Mac books are expensive. But now, since I bought my own, I bought a Mac computer and I'm so excited. I've never had an Apple computer before, like ever. Only Mac things I've had are my iPhones. I've never had an Apple computer and I'm so excited about it. So next week's vlog, you guys, just be prepared to be sick of me. That vlog might be two hours long. I don't know. I am so excited. I'm tired from work because I stayed up till 3 a.m. because that stupid bubble tea but oof, headed to Best Buy to get my computer. And I got my SD card for my um, camera. Got my, what's this? Why can I never remember what that's called? The thing you put the camera on, I got that. Everything is coming in. I might make a short film tonight. Back from Best Buy. Let's see here. Oh my gosh. You guys, I am a computer owner. This is the first computer I've bought as an adult. And of course, we have my camera. Oh my gosh, SD card. Tripod, thought of it, tripod. <laughs> Who am I? It's me, <laughs> the vlogger. <laughs> Is this thing on? Am I recording? Hello? Hello? Testing, testing. One, two, three. Is this thing working? The red light is on. Am I recording something? Ah! Hey y'all, welcome back to Life According to Jenny. 
I think I'm recording something. You guys, I finally got my camera! Do I look amazing? Oh, maybe not after that, sorry. What camera? Hey girl, hey. Okay, you guys, we're actually gonna end this vlog today, which is Tuesday, because I got a lot to do. This camera, this computer, you guys, this computer, I don't know how to do one thing. I'm very confused. I need to take a class. Like, I don't know what this MacBook has going on. Like, hello? Don't you just work yourself or something for the price? I don't know what that has going on. I don't know nothing about it. And I'm very confused. This compute, this camera, we're kind of more on the same page, but me and this computer, if anyone has a MacBook, please send help because I, I don't know what's going on over there. So I'm gonna have to cut this vlog short today because I gotta get this together so I can be ready for Wednesday. I mean, Thursday, I gotta be ready for Thursday. So thanks for watching, I gotta go. Look at my quality though. You guys see me, you see me. I gotta still work out some things. I'm just getting it all together. I need a day to get myself together. So I will see you guys next week. Thanks for coming and talk to you later.